What is up guys and welcome to a quick little impromptu video I decided to do and show what I decided on the fan setup. So what I've ended up with is the SP120 Quiet Editions on my gaming rig. Uh, they really just match the color scheme better. The temperature and the amount of noise they make uh, really works well for the gaming PC. I also added uh, one of those sickle flow fans to the bottom there. You can hardly see it, but uh, that's just try to, trying to keep positive air pressure inside of my case. So. Um, we got the uh, 120s up there, two 140s, 120, and then another 140 exhaust. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty close to neutral or, uh, or positive air pressure. I haven't really tested it out yet, so we'll see how it works. But I think for right now, I'm happy with how that turned out. Now, moving over to my home theater PC. So, uh, you guys probably were wondering what I'm going to do with all these fans that I'm doing all this shootout stuff with. So, what I decided to do was actually put the Noctua's in the home theater PC mainly because they're nice and quiet and because of the looks, you know, they don't look the greatest, but this case is usually hidden underneath a desk and it's, um, you know, it doesn't have a side panel window, so it's not a huge deal that we have ugly fans in it. I also decided to take my old Hyper 2 and 2 and put it in here. This is mainly for noise. Uh, I just had a stock uh, Intel fan heat sink on this uh, chip. I decided I might as well put the old Hyper 2 and 2 on here. We'll keep it cooler and it will keep it quieter. I just decided to go with another sickle flow fan on the actual cooler, so that's working really well. One little thing I did since I um, installed this uh, new NZXT fan controller, as you guys know, uh, you can notice that I removed the fan controller from the Fractal Design case. So uh, all my fans in this case are on this fan controller, so I no longer need this one. Um, so I went ahead and did a nice little, well I think it's nice, it's probably kind of meh for most people, but uh, I went ahead and did a little bit of a fan mod. Uh, so this is the old fan controller, and all I did is kind of drill out a little tiny space there, I hope you guys can see that, and basically mounted the, um, the old fan controller from the Fractal Design up here, up top, and it works perfect. So yeah, I have the two Noctua fans on this fan controller right here that I can access from the front panel. And then I do have the sickle flow connected to the motherboard. So uh, this motherboard has a problem where it only can detect, I think like two fans at a time. So I figured rather than uh, dealing with that, I might as well just leave the CPU uh, fan hooked up to the motherboard, let that be controlled. And then I'll have direct control on the front panel over here with my old fan controller. So. I think that really worked out well. Thank you guys so much for checking out this quick little update. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them. But anyways, guys, I will talk to you later.